Hello YouTubers, this is Triple Seven Forever coming at you with another long anticipated highly sought after model. A lot of people have been waiting on this model for quite some time. I'm one of them. And they finally brought it out. This is a Gemini Jets 200 Airbus A330-300 and 1-200 scale model. I bought this along with the Air China I just posted on September 26, 2014 from Troy's Toys out of Olin Park, Kansas. His website is www.troystoysinc.com. I think he still had a couple of these still left to sell as we speak. And based what I'm uh, hearing so far, this model is pretty much flying off the shelves right now as we speak. Uh, this is a highly sought after model. I don't think you want to sleep on this one because a lot of people slept on that 777-300ER that Air Canada came out almost two years ago. Uh, a lot of people slept on it, and that model's hard to find. And most Air Canada models, once they sell out, they become hard to find and highly sought after. And this one will be no exception. So with that said, I'm going into the detail. Um, Air Canada is part of the Star Alliance, along with the uh, prestigious airlines such as United Airlines, Lufthansa, Air China, Thai Airways, Singapore Airlines, Air New Zealand. This is a four-star airline based out of the uh, main hub is based out of Toronto, but they also have uh, hubs in Montreal. They have some in uh, Vancouver, but their main hub is out of Toronto, Pearson International Airport. So with that said, I'm going to get in here into the details of this uh, box and model and all that good stuff. So there you go, Air Canada. A four-star airline, the only four-star airline in North America besides JetBlue. So let that tell you, that's very prestigious. So, and then there's the uh, the Air Canada. Model. I'm getting ready to show you. The pictures don't do no justice, but it's real awesome. There, and then there's the stand. Yeah, the stand there. The pad on the stand, so you ain't worry about that. Your paint scratching up. And this is the uh, back of the box. You see uh, Air Canada, I guess Air Canada gave Gemini the, uh, the permission to go here and make this model. You know, Gemini just got to get permission from airlines before they make a model. So, if you don't know, you know. See? And then, that's the side of the box there. So, now I'm getting ready to show you the model. Oh, that, that is beautiful. This icy blue. I like that icy blue. Woo! That icy blue is sexy. This is one magnificent model. You know, like I said, the picture didn't do y'all no justice. Now, once you see this model in person, you're going to be blown away. If you like that triple seven, you'll definitely like this one. So, with that said, I'm getting ready to go in details. Bring, bring this over here closer. Okay. Get this focus here, folks. Okay. All right, I'm going to start at the front of the aircraft like always. Uh, there's the parcel registration number, 931. Then there's the Star Lines logo. Like I said, uh, the airlines they are affiliated with as well. Then there's the uh, front cargo container door. And then there's the big Air Canada logo. Billboard across the fuselage. This beautiful icy blue fuselage. And then these the engine. These are CF6 engines. I believe they are CF6 engines. Is if they something else, please let me know. And then there's the uh, wing tip. It's icy blue as well. Wow. And then there's the uh, rear cargo container door. Then there's the boat bin door. Yeah, you see the boat bin door. Then there's the registration number C dash G F A F. C dash G F A F. That's the registration number. Then you see the big uh maple leaf. You know, that's the uh symbol of Canada. You know, if you see it on a flag, that's the Canadian symbol on a flag. Then you see the registration number on top of the tail there, 931. And then you turn it back this way. There's the APU exhaust system. Then there's the tail here, pretty impressive. I like this tail. Then there's the registration number, C-GFAF. Then you move along here. 
there's the, 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 the winglet. And then there's the uh, beacon light there. Then you see the big engines there, the CF6 engines. Then you see the Air Canada uh, billboard across the beautiful fuselage. And uh, the engines do turn. They turn barely. Yeah, there you go. Um, and then uh, get to the front of the aircraft again. Get real close. I can get this real focused, folks. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Star Alliance. Then there's the door. Very detailed doors. Did a great job on these doors. Then there's the front cockpit window. Then there's the windshield wiper. Oh, very impressive there. Now I'm going to show you the uh then now I'm going to show you the uh gear. Yeah, there's the gear lights. You can barely see them but they're there. Yeah, they there. You can barely see them though. Um now I'm going to show you the bottom of the fuselage. The gear. There's the antenna. There's the beacon light. There's the uh stand hole where the stand goes in at. There's the gears. Here's Gemini Jets. And the uh the gears do tilt, yeah. They do roll. Now I'm gonna put it on the stand and show you from the top angle. There. There you go. Okay, there you go, folks. There it is. Boy, ain't it beautiful? Woo! Now I'm going to show you in the flying angle. There. Now I'm going to go in details with this top of this model, top of the fuselage here. Okay, folks, there's the antenna, one. Then there's a little humpback for the internet, Wi-Fi, mobile usage. They put it on a lot of these planes now. Then there's the, uh, the beacon light. Then there's another antenna. Wow, no illuminate light. Wow, it's probably there. Yeah, don't worry. About it. I ain't worried about it. Okay, there you go, folks. Now I'm gonna show you from underneath this uh, angle as well. Okay. All right. They do use this on certain international routes. Uh, I forgot what, the, what routes they use them on now. But it's a long range aircraft. 330. So pretty nice. Highly recommend this model if you ain't got it yet. It just came out maybe about. Came out this week. And uh, everybody just getting them. And I'm and word has it this thing is flying off the shelf. So don't sleep on it. Well, with that said, this is all I have for right now. I have some more coming. And uh, if you ain't got this model, please get it. Put it on your list to get it. In the meantime, I hope you enjoyed this video review. Please rate and subscribe and leave your comments at the bottom of this video. I'd like to hear back from you. In the meantime, take care. God bless.